tedious. Abominable. Like Al Day said, David Warfield. David Warfield? No. A tycoon who owns all the sleazy tabloids? Au contraire, mon ami, he owns all the sleazy tabloids and the Daily Planet. Tedious. Don't tell me you only read the pictures. The fact is, Mr. White, that I only read the ledger. A ledger which the previous owners paid so little attention to, I bought the paper out from under them. The Daily Planet hasn't made any money in three years. And the name of the game is making money. Ladies and gentlemen, my daughter, Lacey Warfield. Thanks, Daddy. It's very nice to meet you, ma'am. Mr. White, Lacey will be helping you. Helping me? Helping me what? What I have here are some mock copies of our new layout. It's super, don't you think? The suit's not right here, but obviously we can change that. Excuse me, <clears throat> Mr. Warfield, but the, the world isn't uh, really on the brink. Isn't that headline uh, irresponsible? Maybe, but it'll sell a hell of a lot of newspapers. Mr. White, don't do anything rash. If you think I'm going to let you turn this grand old lady into one of your bimbos... Mr. White, may I point out that Daddy holds all of your contracts, which you will have to honor. Excuse moi your spoiledness. Why is Lois trying to speak French? Um... I have a plane to catch to Paris for the emergency minister's conference and uh, Not so fast. All trips are cancelled. You mean my trip to Paris is cancelled? Mr. White, you come with me. I want to see your books. The rest of you get back to work. Oh, so I don't think we're being treated fairly. I'm going to speak to Miss Warfield. Me too. Excuse me, Miss Warfield. <clears throat> I think I speak for all of us when I say that we'll do our best to cooperate. Thank you. Um, but a reporter's first allegiance has to be to the truth. The people of this city depend on us, and we can't let them down. Thank you. Is he for real? Um, 100%, and, uh, I like him that way, okay? Oh, you have a thing for him. For Clark? No! <laughs> He's kind of cute. Uh, look... Miss Warfield, Clark is the oldest living Boy Scout, okay? He's he's trustworthy, he's helpful, he's loyal, he's obedient, he... I don't know how to tell you this, I just don't think he'd be attracted to somebody like you. Oh, don't be silly! All men like me! I'm very, very rich! 